back to A Moment in History. I'm Seth Udinsky. In this moment in history, let's explore an event in the history of England that goes down as one of its most famous. The event has become known as a national day of celebration in England. It's a story of intrigue and conspiracy as a group of English insurrectionists attempted to blow up the English Parliament building at Westminster Palace on November 5th 1605. Remember, remember the 5th of November has become as meaningful a phrase in England as give me liberty or give me death might be for you and me here in America. Let's explore this thrilling tale now, known in history as the Gunpowder Plot. To understand why this event happened, we need to know the religious climate in England because religion was the key factor. In 1605, England was a Protestant nation, but there were many who desired to wrench the religious control of the country back into the hands of the Roman Catholic Church, which had dominated England from the late Roman Empire up until the mid-16th century. But the Protestant Reformation took England by storm, and it would take England with it. So we come to the year 1605, where a group of Catholic conspirators set in motion a mass assassination attempt. Their mission was to blow up the English Parliament in Westminster Palace, killing the members of Parliament and the Protestant King James I with it. And by the way, James is the same King James for whom our King James Bible is named after. Their goal was to overthrow the Protestant powers of England and return the country to Roman Catholicism. Among the conspirators were Robert Catsby, whose father had had negative dealings with the former English Protestant monarch Queen Elizabeth I, and Guy Fawkes, an English Catholic zealot. As it turns out, historians tend to blame Fawkes for the plot's ultimate failure. He and several others had planted explosives underneath Westminster Palace on November 4th, but Sir Thomas Nivett caught Fawkes in the room with the explosives in the early morning hours of November 5th, 1605, the planned day for the attack. Fawkes revealed the conspiracy to his captors under severe pressure. Parliament was saved and the other conspirators were eventually tracked down and tried for treason. All were sentenced to death, but Fawkes was killed in a fall while attempting a last-ditch escape before his execution. Today, people in England still remember the day their governmental system was almost destroyed as a day of celebration. The 5th of November will no doubt go down as one of the most thrilling thwarts of a mass assassination in world history. Thanks so much for joining me once again for a moment in history. Thanks for watching this video. For more content like this, make sure to check out some of the other videos we have on this channel.